a pig gate. Something we have not had for five years, believe it or not. <laughs> Sounds crazy when you say it out loud, but for five years we've been jumping the pig fence and taking down sections of pig fence to get pigs in and out. And now we are moving on up and we are putting a gate in. We have a gate to the pig pen. Crazy. That is amazing. Oh my goodness, you guys, I came out here to check on her and we have baby piglets. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven so far. Oh my goodness! Okay, I'll be back. Oh my goodness. They all look like the mom and dad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we had one stillborn. Oh my goodness. I am just not believing this. I checked on her an hour ago and she was totally fine. <gasps> you did so good, Mama. We have 10 live baby piglets so far. Uh oh. <laughs> that one keeps on going and trying to eat the mom. Her placenta earlier. Well, I'm just hanging out in the pig pen watching the cute little piglets nurse. And behind me, we have our other expectant mama who is super restless right now and just pacing back and forth. She's not real happy about being in the birthing shelter. So. Hey y'all, we are still out here in the pig shelter. I have been just sitting here watching these little babies nurse. I am still waiting on the other sow to give birth. She's very settled down, just laying down. Um, so it might still be a little bit longer or it might not, who knows. So it's about 10 o'clock right now. I'm gonna give it a little bit more time but I gotta be up at 5.30 in the morning, so hopefully I don't have to pull an all-nighter for this. All right, well, still no babies. Looks like I'm in for another long, sleepless night again. Well, it is about 5.45 in the morning, and it appears she made it all the way through the night and did not have her babies. All 
All right, well, I'm back in the pig pen, and look who's still pregnant. All right, well, apparently we're gonna have a severe thunderstorm. All right, well, I've got some bad news. Um, we just had a ton of rain with that storm, and last weekend we had a ton of rain, and it's just really wet out here, and I didn't realize that the inside of the pig shelter uh, was a little bit lower than all the ground surrounding it. So we've got a lot of water in the pig pen, and I've put a ton of hay in there, you know, to kind of keep the pigs up out of the water, and that's, kind of working. My feet are soaked from being in there. Um, I've got to dig a trench, um, probably on two different sides of the pig shelter to try to get some of this water to drain off of there. So the center of the pig pen will start to dry out. So I'll show you here what I'm talking about. See all that water right beside the pig pen? I'm gonna dig a trench out into the cow pasture um, which is a little bit lower um, to try to see if we can get some of this water to drain off so we can keep these piglets dry because wet piglets mean cold piglets mean not healthy possibly dying piglets so gotta get to work <laughs> actually drying out quite a bit so I'm gonna keep on working it is a muddy mess out here y'all these pigs I tell ya I check on them all day I just checked on her maybe 30 minutes ago. We've got three babies on the ground out here. Hi, baby. All right, you guys, this one. Oh, this one came out bum first, back feet first. Good job, little buddy. All right, let me grab him and dry him off and rouse him. He just licked me. I know, they have dirty mouth. Oh, look, Lily. He's licking his brother and biting him. Where's my little favorite small one? <laughs> look, oh, this one's sad. sad. <laughs> that one's sad. Okay. It's depressed. No, he's sad. No, he's okay. Honey, <laughs> <laughs> you, you okay? Bro, you were under there. <laughs> For little piggy. Don't go back under no. Y'all look. I'm not letting you. Don't go under there. <laughs> oh, it's one of her babies. Oh. Ew. Oh. <laughs> it's slimy. It's still a little slimy. Oh, I told you I haven't touched them, bro. I was like, I ain't touching that thing. I know it's cute. Right? Slimy oh, but cute. All oh, of them are like white. Oh. Really? Yeah, this is the this is the this only is black and white one so far. The other two are pink. Okay, you gotta dry the pig off. Nope. We got another one coming. Huh mama? Yep, I think we've got another one coming. 
Lots of meconium, though, coming out. Oh, here we go. Here's another one. All right. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. There you go. Let's get your mouth cleared off. All right, so we're gonna give them, as soon as they're born, we give them something called Nutri-Drench. It just gives them a little bit of an oral vitamin. Just gets them off to a good start. All right, so we're gonna flip this guy over like this. Yeah, she just had one. And just squirt it in their mouth. And there she is. Hey baby, it's baby number five. <laughs> All right, let's go meet your mama. Everybody's happily nursing over here on this side. And then over here on this side, these guys are still trying to figure it out little guy was one the one that just came out hind legs first wasn't breathing when he came out so I really had to rouse him and tussle him up a little bit but he is ready to go I think we've got another baby that is feet first I'm gonna wait till mama starts pushing, but I might have to help her out. Oh, I see a foot. Come on, mama. There you go. There you are, baby. I am so glad that I got to be here for this one. We are up to seven piglets. Everybody looks really vigorous and healthy. Everybody's nursing. Um, and I'm just so glad that I got to be here and witness this. This is our first time breeding pigs. And um, it's been a great experience so far. So, um, total we're up to 17 piglets between the two moms um, so that should definitely keep us busy for a while so this mama looks like um, she might be slowing down a little bit she's you know nice and relaxed and doesn't seem like she's laboring quite as hard so um, I don't know if she's done um, there could be more um, the last two were uh, breech births, um, so so we'll.
Good job, Mama.